어. It's an Earth Pulse. So you survived. Let's not count our blessings just yet. It looks like we've been sealed inside. But at least we're still alive. Can't say the same would be true if we stayed in that place. An Earth Pulse. So that's what this is. Yeah. It's like a river flowing with nature's life energy. Earth pulses can be found all over the world, but normally you can't see or interact with them. Then how'd we wind up inside one? When Inominat and Lafisette's power collided, the shock must have torn it open. If that's the case, it's possible that Lafisette possesses the power to return us home, but... Uh... He can't do much in this state. He's liable to turn into a demon any moment now. Don't talk like that! Is this because he overused his powers? It's not too late to stop it. If a Moloch occupies a pure vessel, 
he can be prevented from transforming into a demon. Even you? This lucky coin is my vessel. There's a catch to this one, though. It can only serve as a vessel for someone with the Reaper's powers. Then that's no help at all. An exorcist would work. We offer our own bodies as vessels for Malachim, so that we can use them for the Abbey's purposes. I volunteer to serve as your Moloch's vessel. I see. So we just need your body with us, not your legs. Not one step closer! I'll kill myself before you lay a hand on me. The Moloch will become a demon, and you'll be stuck here forever! You don't mince words, do you? Know your foes and strike where they're weak. The basis of all combat. As cowardly as I'd expect from a disciple of Artorius. No, this is personal. Once I regain my exorcist powers, I vow to challenge you, Demon Velvet! If I lose, I'll do whatever you wish. If you want me to die or to become a vessel, so be it. <laughs> uh, uh, Velvet, don't die. Fine. What's the Moloch's name? Normally, it is decided by their masters, but since I do not own him yet, I need to know. He's not a thing to be owned. He's Lafiset. <laughs> Lafiset. I see. O oh, child of the fountain of creation, these vows we exchange, may our purpose, resplendent, help to purify this cursed world. Remember this true name I bestow unto you. How the hell did we end up here? What's going on? That little brat! He actually unsealed the Earth Pulse? What was that? Huh. Guess this is the end of the Velvet World Tour Revengeathon. What an anticlimax. Not that I really care either way. We don't know that she's dead. Dead or alive, she's done. No way she'd keep going after seeing how outmatched she is. Bet you ten gold that I'm right. Ten gold? You're on. What in the... Luffy said, what did that exorcist do? What happened to you? I see. So that exorcist woman pledged herself as Lafayette's vessel? Where did she head off to then? If you two wound up here, then odds are that exorcist disappeared somewhere nearby. Then we'll find her. Sheesh, are you never not worked up about something? I said I would save him, so I will. Besides... His power is just what I need. Don't you forget our little wager now, alright? 
My darling Ten Gold, murdered in his crib by a thug! I won't let her get away from me! Take a look at this. Scout ship setting sail. So exorcists are actually the vessels for their Malachim. You can do that too, can't you, Magulu? Of course! This fair maiden has won the Malachim's Choice Award, Most Desirable Vessel, three years running! Oh? Then you wouldn't mind replacing Eleanor as Lafisette's vessel, I hope. Thanks! But no thanks. I have my hands full dealing with Bienfu as it is. If I ate Bienfu, you'd have room. Didn't work, kiddo. You saw it with your own eyes. Even if only for an instant, that kid actually held his own against the power of Enominat. Not even the resplendent Magilu can handle something of that power. Indeed. After everything we've seen, it's obvious there's more to Lafayette than meets the eye. Yeah, but that Eleanor woman was still able to become his vessel. That's because, unlike Miss Magilu, Madam Eleanor actually tries! Anyway, we need to find her and beat her. She'll just bring us more trouble the longer she's out there. Oh, we'll find her. No doubt about it.
again well look who set up shop here you couldn't have shown up at a better time we need more supplies I'm happy to help you all but this time I really really needs to charge a little extra how much extra are we talking here Ooh, you haven't heard the stories little turtles word has it there's a spooky monster that's been eating traveling merchants around these parts <laughs> eating merchants she takes the shape of a black-haired girl, and when she finds greedy merchants, she gobbles them up head first. Although, if the greedy merchant was a turtle's, I bet she'd start with the crunchy shell. Ah! I'm not greedy, I swears it. Look, I had special sales going on. Everything's marked down to normal prices. How generous of you. Magulu, give the nice turtles the smile he lives for. Always a pleasure. <laughs> Much obliged!
I thought you'd be long gone. I apologize for disappearing on you. I was there, and then in the next moment, I was gone. And Lafayette? He's resting inside me. As far as I can tell, he seems healthy again. Your name's Eleanor, right? If I defeat you, you'll be his vessel and follow my orders until the day you die. 
I accept. But conversely, should you lose, I will take your life. Do you plan on fighting alone? I can handle myself. to help you fight. Of course! This duel is me versus you! <laughs> I'd better not hear any excuses after your defeat, then. Here it comes! 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 We're done here. Never let your guard down, even when victorious! <clears throat> Why did you stop? I know you can't kill me as long as I'm his vessel. I'm just abiding by the same terms. Had you won, you'd have killed me. True, but a duel is a duel. The Abbey shaped you well. However! <laughs> Once your sword is drawn, never waver. Control your feelings to control the tide of battle, right? Lord Artorius' teachings? <gasps> what a failure I have been. I'll... I'll keep my word. I will follow your orders. To the day I die! Don't! My body... I can't move! How? Since when can a Moloch overpower his own vessel? Luffy said, are you feeling better now? Y yeah. Looks like her body is reacting to the bond. Yeah, I know the drill. She'll get a high fever and stay zonked out for a bit. No biggie. Carrying her will slow us down. We can't afford that risk when we're venturing into parts unknown. Let's rest here until she's recovered, then. She's one of us now, isn't she? As long as she's Lafayette's vessel. That's true.